<laughs> the uh, little bitty helicopter just took off by itself and flew away <laughs> and I finally was able to kill the power and uh, I saw it drop out of the sky thankfully I'm pretty sure I know where it landed crash landed that is so we'll see if we can find it, what's left of it. It dropped, as you can tell from the video, probably a hundred feet or more straight down. So we'll see what's left. All right, here we go. Well, one piece of landing gear, where to go? missing one of my 3d printed landing gear might have fallen from the sky sure don't see it here let's just bore into the ground somehow uh, Still got lights blinking. That's a good sign. Where'd it go? Must have fallen out while I was in flight. All right, well, let's see if I can get this thing to fire back up. Alrighty, let's see here. Well, how do you like that? Alright. Okay. Well, it still flies, so that's good. And, uh... Oh, there's my... There it is. Right there. And it broke the broke the pins off of the landing gear, so no problem. I can print another one. But there it is, a little bitty Simna X5SW flying on its own <laughs> and trying to trying to take off and fly right now. Let me cut this to make it pull off. Okay. So yeah. A little breezy out here so that probably wasn't too good of an idea to fly this little tiny toy in the wind actually it's not that bad probably a one mile an hour wind but for this little thing one mile an hour is uh, is too much you can hear the wind blowing on the camera probably so anyway that's the great adventure of the Sima X5SW and its attempt.